Tracy. Hey, ladies. How Hello. Are How are you? Good. Good. It's really great to see you. So good to see you, too. I was thinking about you um, the other night because it was last year that we saw each other in person, and you came strutting in in a Green Bay Packer shirt. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, oh, okay. Yeah. We're doing this now. Yes, I did. I was strutting around the, the remotes. I was just asking for trouble. You were. You usually are. Yeah. <laughs> it's a Minnesota girl. That's how we know it's her if she's asking for trouble. <laughs> it's, but all that being said, it was, it was very nice to actually see football be back this weekend. So yeah, I know. Was, emotions were high in my house. I Mine too. To oh, <laughs> Lord. I know. Our men are both. Yeah. Huh? So is it houses divided for you too? So both of you guys, are they Minnesota fans or just not just Packer haters? No. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. Um, no, we both have Patriots uh, spouses and partners. Yes. Yeah. And so that, and because of that, the Patriots are divided now with Brady being on the Bucks, and it's, it's, it's a whole thing. Yeah. It for in our house though, we're excited because we have more football to root for. Yeah. So we've got <laughs> Titans, we've got Bucks, we've got Pats. Um, I don't think that your partner feels that way. He does he's not, not feel that way. About the box. <laughs> so he, he's hating the, I mean, what is he doing then? He's is just, he's so, he's such, so he was born and raised in Boston. And so he's a uh, giant Pats fan. And he, I mean, he's so crazy about, but he's in four football leagues, four fantasy foot, four, four <laughs> fantasy football leagues. So annoying, isn't it? He has a Tom Brady tattoo, which is now a Buccaneers tattoo. Oh <laughs> Wait, he turned it into a book? No, no it's not. Right. It just okay. is. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> like, yes, I was saying, oh, my God. What did he do? Is it his no, it's not a face tattoo. It's the number 12 on his hand. He loves Tom Brady. And then, and then so Tom Brady leaves and goes to the Bucks, and then, and then Gronk comes out of retirement, and, and, and Martin was like, oh, my God, he's coming to play for the Pats. Nope went to the back. It was Bucks. just, it's been crazy. So, um, but Cam Newton did really, really, really good. Yeah, he did. Like he did. We were happy in the house. So you guys are so, so it's been fun because like, I mean, I'm a, I'm a huge Broncos fan, but my house is kind of divided with like Minnesota for most of them. And then my middle son can tell you every stat of every player that's ever, he's 15, bless his heart, he's the cutest thing in the world, but he loves Cam Newton. And so he has a Cam, we got him a Cam Newton football. And it's the only time I've seen one of my men in my house cry. He cried. Oh, he cried. When you got when you gave him the football, or when he went to the Pats. No, when he when he got the football, and he's like <laughs> in his little Christmas PJs, he puts his head down, and all he says after like a minute, he goes, "Best mom ever." And I was like, "Oh, oh which is so <laughs> sweet." <laughs> you are oh peaking as a mom. Yes, I did it. I did it. But everybody here, as when I told the story in Denver, ready are like, "Screw Cam Newton." And I'm like, oh, "Come on, it was a good mom moment." Didn't get any. <laughs> That's amazing. Everybody be Cam happy Newton's for me. Easy to love. Right. Yeah. Well, let's talk about this next year for you guys because you got exciting stuff with the postponed Luke Bryan tour. Hey, we're coming back next year. You guys are on that tour. Yes. I'm I mean, I'm so excited. It's it's, it's really, really cool. cool. It's, it's like, like, you know, if anyone's gonna be allowed to tour, Luke Bryan will. <laughs> and so uh maybe, maybe even if, if we're not allowed, he's still going, going to. Yeah. Um so we're we're really excited and um yeah, we we've been in the, in the meantime, we've been really busy, like really busy. It's been really, really wonderful. Um, but we went straight into the studio. As soon as we got pulled off the road, we were like, okay, what else can we be doing? And, um, we asked Natalie to join. We're like, I know we'll ask Natalie to join runaway June. <laughs> Hey -o, here I am. <laughs> We're going to give you the Disney version. We decided to make it interesting for us yeah. in quarantine. Yeah, we did not want a boring quarantine. No, we did not want to be bored. Um, she really, though, yeah. she's, I feel like, you know, it's hard right now to create a story or to really have a lot to st say because no one can do anything. So I feel like Natalie coming in and being a part of the band has just given us revived energy and something to talk about and something to work something towards. Positive and, to yeah, talk about. Yeah, it's been really amazing yeah so um we went straight to the studio to record the christmas ep which we just got, got done with and that's been a, such a fun process we love christmas music and um, being able to create with each other right away was really fun where normally you'd go straight on the road and start touring yeah um but instead we got to kind of like learn each other in that way um 
yeah, it's been great. We've been writing for album number two. Oh. We uh, shot our music video where it's like, we've been busy. busy. But, right. Yeah, but Tracy, yeah. everything's twice as hard to do. So it makes <laughs> us feel really even more busy. Yeah. It's like, we're so busy, but it's just like, it takes twice the effort to do things right, right now. So logging on to stuff like this took like a half an hour. <laughs> where exactly, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> You're like, we can compliment each other's clothes right away. And now we're like, hold on, dot com. I have no oh idea. God, yeah. I am. <laughs> I'm just grateful I'm not homeschooling a kid right now. Yeah. I'm. Oh, that's what I said just... before. I was like, this is probably not water for me. <laughs> with all of it. Not, it's not good water. for you. The worst. Where I feel like we should all be in alcohol sales during this pandemic. <laughs> I feel sure. like that's like a, a that's company. A one thing. That's, not getting shut yeah. down. <laughs> well, ladies, it is very good to see you. And I'm so happy things are going. I'm so happy things are busy because it's, it's good you, stuff Ellie. coming. It, it, it is. It's been really positive and we're very grateful. All right, Runaway Jude. Always great to see you. We'll see you in person very soon, please. Okay. Yes. Bye, Bye, Tracy. Bye. And a big thank you to Mountain High Appliance for all of our ACM coverage. Mountain High Appliance, Colorado's favorite appliance store since 1993. Visit a Mountain High Appliance near you or check them out online at mountainhighappliance.com.